This is Eagle Al. Let's get straight into it. My guy, Rodney McLeod. Rodney McLeod sound like he want to come back to Philly, finish his career in Philly. And I love to hear this. I love to hear this. The only knock on him is his age. He's 32. You know, it is coming to an end as far as his career. And he said something like he want a mind end of his career in Philly. But let's listen to Rodney McLeod say it and not me. It happened. Uh, I mean, that, w- that would be an amazing that I could compete for a championship with, but also who values me, you know, for who I am as a player and as a man. Now, real quick, a lot of our producers stay down in South Jersey, big Philly fans. Philly lost some safeties. Yeah. You were there. Any chance of a reunion? Oh, man, you know, you never know what could happen. Uh, <laughs> I mean, that, w- that would be an amazing, uh, I think, finish to uh, my career, I would say. Uh, to leave and come back, it's like the the ultimate, you know, story and, and fairy tale, right? So you know, you never know what could happen. Uh, never could close a door. Uh, door might present itself. Mm-hmm. We'll mm-hmm. see. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that definitely sound like a man that want to come back. I know we get wrapped up in the rookies, the um, Dion branches and things like that. Um, I know Amos out there. You know, we getting wrapped up with all these names, but nobody's mentioning Rodney McLeod. Like, he was a slouch in Indianapolis. Like, of course, the name that drawn everybody there, and now he's a cowboy, Stephon Gilmore. But that safety over the top was balling. I think I said this, but PFF had him rated like an 80 overall grade. That's really, really good. Um, You bring in a guy who won the chip with the Eagles, who won the chip with the Eagles, who loved the Philadelphia Eagles, um, I think we made a mistake because I always felt like we chose Anthony Harris over Rodney McLeod, but Anthony Harris ended up not even making the team, and Rodney McLeod was a straight baller at Indianapolis. And the Colts, they had a solid defense. That Colts team beat the Chiefs. The problem is they don't have a quarterback or an offense, so guys like Rodney McLeod, Stephon Gilmore, and stuff like that were balling. They held us to 16 points, and we had one of the most explosive offense. So, yeah, man, you, you bring back that leadership, bring back that dog. He did have two picks, I think, like eight pass deflections last season. So, like I said, man, this is the guy nobody's talking about. But it's kind of expected, 32. Um, he, he's probably last on everybody's plate, but, hell, bring him back here. Bring him back here in Philly. Let him ball out. Let him prove his worth. And just let him finish it out in Philly, man. Let him finish it out in Philly. This move make a lot of sense. Because I, I just, I, I love Reed Blankenship. I love Kayvon Wallace, especially what he did towards the end of the season. But if you telling me we're coming into this season as those two as the starters, I don't know. But a Rodney McLeod and Reed Blankenship, and then you rotate uh, Wallace, I like it. I like it. And then, like I said, you got to establish safety. Who can cover? Who can hit? Um, he did not fall off a cliff. So, yeah, man, um, bring him back. Bring him back. One-year deal. See what he'll take. Like I said, the market is not strong for him. So he probably appreciate just the Eagles taking him back. But knowing how he probably got his eyes on it already. Or let's see what we do in the draft. If we get somebody we really like in the second round, I still think you should bring him in. Hell, if how we plunge, I highly doubt it on the safety in the first round. You still got to do with the Rodney McLeod. Uh, but we really like the safety in the draft. Still get him, but you still got to bring in a Rodney McLeod. You're going to need guys rotating, man. That's what made the safety position okay for us in Philadelphia. We rotated a lot. So, yeah, man. Uh Bring him in. Just just bring him in. See what he got. One-year deal. See if he has set the vet minimum. If not, just pay him a little more. And, yeah, let him finish his career in Philly. But, hey, man, what do you think of how do you feel about Rodney McLeod? Rumor, basically, to come back. I would love it. I would love it a lot. Like I said, the PFF, the stats. He did not fall off a cliff. And I think we made a mistake picking Anthony Harris over, over McLeod. But this is Eagle Owl. I'm up.